recently, I caught up with a driver trainer, Eddie Dennis, and visited a couple of standouts in his stable. So Eddie, you have a filly who is in one of the finals named Bright Olive, and she's actually been a huge comeback story for you. Tell me about that. Yeah, last year as a two-year-old, uh, she went her maiden start at Harrington, and then she was in to go the following weekend to the first elimination of the Sire Stakes, and uh, I was blowing her out a trip, and after she turned around, she knuckled over, and uh, she cracked her pasture in the back, and uh, we had to ship her out right away to get uh, operated on, and she had uh, five screws put in. And she's come back now, and she hasn't had a problem whatsoever with it. She, uh, you know, rehabbed really good, and um, she's good and sound so far. So you've also got a boy in the Glamour division, and tell me about him, McMurray Hanover. Uh, McMurray has been a big asset to my barn. Um, I come across him by a uh, friend by a friend, and um, he sent him down to me last September. And we started him off uh, in an overnight race, and we win that one, and we went right into the sire stakes, and uh, we had some luck last year as a two-year-old uh, with him, and he's come back this year as a three-year-old, and he's done well this year. I think he's got probably like 92,000 on his card since he's been down here, so uh, he's been a big asset to the barn. So with actually each horse, what do you think your chances are in winning maybe two on the big day? <laughs> I think it's like everybody, you got to have the draw. Uh, when I win the last leg uh, of the eliminations, I had a great trip, uh, a dream trip, a trip I've been looking for uh, ever since I've had him down here, and uh, I was able to get it, and uh, and he fought hard through the lane and got by a, a fairly tough horse. Okay, well, sometimes lightning does strike twice, so maybe you'll get that dream tri trip again. Uh, that would be nice. Uh, we're going to leave it up to Corey. Uh, he's going to drive him for me in the final. Um, so uh, hopefully he can work out some kind of trip, and, uh, and we're close to the top of the lane, and it falls our way. Oh, gosh, I guess I should ask who's driving Bright Olive. I'm going to show for Bright Olive. She, she's a little funny to deal with, and uh, uh, she's a typical filly, so... Uh, I pretty much know her pretty good, so uh, I'll show for her around there and see what we can get done. All right. Well, best of luck. Thanks.